your side. A Charlton County, Georgia teenager is dead this afternoon after drowning in the St. Mary's River. So this is a new photo we're about to show you. We just received of 17 year old Raymond Wade Jr. He called for help from the water at about five o'clock last night and never came back up. Wade was a football player, we're told, at Charlton County High School. Well, First Coast News' McKenna Rodriguez joins us live now from Folkestone, Georgia, where she has been following this story all morning long. McKenna, you know you've had a chance to speak with some witnesses there. It says he wish he could have been there and done more to help save Raymond. Yeah, that's right, Lou. Well, I'm actually here at the high school where the superintendent says students and staff will have the opportunity to talk to grief counselors all day who, you know, were friends or saw Raymond every single day. But just down the street from here is where the St. Mary's River is, and that is the ramp and the dock that Raymond was last seen at swimming, struggling for help. Now, deputies say... Um, they, they arrived on scene just after five. Friends of Wade's told officers they tried to help him but were unsuccessful. This led to a six hour search on the river for Wade. Charlton, Nassau and Camden County Sheriff's offices along with the Georgia Department of Natural Resources and Florida Department of Fish and Wildlife used divers and small sonar units in, to search for him in the water. Now Wade's teammates, family and friends were also down here helping. One camper I spoke with saw Wade swimming earlier in the day and left just before everything happened. I am so sorry for that family and I wish I could have been here a few more minutes to maybe change the situation. Uh, I don't know what to say. My regards to them. My heart hurts for them. And we were down at the river earlier today and actually saw a family and a uh, actual teammate from the football team that came down to throw some flowers in the river to honor their friend. Uh, the officers say that there was no foul play that they suspect, but we'll continue to keep you updated with the latest. Reporting in Charlton County, McKenna Rodriguez, First Coast News on your side.